हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू सुरेश अग्रवाल्स मैथमेटिक्स शॉर्टकट ऑफ लेट आई हैव गिवन यू अ नंबर ऑफ अमेजिंग फैक्ट्स इन मैथमेटिक्स यू नो देयर आर सम कंसेप्ट्स व्हिच वी कीप ऑन लर्निंग बट वी कांट एक्सटेंड देम फर्दर सपोज आई टॉक ऑफ द सम ऑफ फर्स्ट एन नेचुरल नंबर्स 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus up to n we all know that the sum of first n natural numbers is n n plus 1 by 2 likewise for sum of squares we have a formula n n plus 1 2 n plus 1 by 6 i think you must be knowing that also and sum of cubes if you square the first formula n into n plus 1 by 2 whole square you get the sum of cubes of first n natural numbers what if we have the fourth powers something which we have not thought about yet so in this video i'll be telling you how you can calculate the sum of fourth powers of natural numbers that is first n natural numbers so let's see the concept and before that let me remind you about the 24 pdf short trick course an amazing course in which you find around 350 short tricks to calculate 10 times faster even uh, school students are getting benefit uh, from that particular course because they are developing that speed of calculations which is required for success in higher classes so if you want a copy of that 24 pdf short trick course a very very nominal cost associated with the course mind you you can whatsapp 9896369963 or visit www.sureshagarwal.in for getting a copy of that particular course so let's see the concept in hand we want to calculate the sum of fourth powers of first n natural numbers that is i'm talking about 1 power 4 plus 2 power 4 likewise if you have to calculate up to a natural number n so n power 4 so what is the way out for us finding the fourth power of numbers is very difficult and we cannot find the fourth powers individually and then add them that will be too much time consuming so there are three different ways in which we can represent this formula the first one is the factor form in the factor form the last number n comes first and after that we have 2n plus 1 as the second factor n plus 1 as the third factor and the fourth factor is a quadratic factor actually so this is 3n square plus 3n minus 1 that is the fourth factor and you need to divide all these four factors by 30 to get to our answer i'll give you a very simple example here suppose we need to calculate only up to 1 power 4 plus 2 power 4 so this is just demonstration you all know that this is 1 and this is 16 so our answer has to be 17 so let's see whether we can get the answer by putting n equal to 2 here so n equal to 2 is second factor becomes 2n plus 1 that is 5 third factor n plus 1 that is 3 and the fourth factor so 2 square is 4 4 3 is a 12 12 plus 6 18 minus 1 17 and then we have the denominator as 30 so you can see 5 to the 10 3 to the 30 cancels the 30 and we have 17 here so the formula exactly fits in our uh, left hand side that is 1 power 4 plus 2 power 4 up to n power 4 is these four factors divided by 30 a little bit uh, difficult you know uh, why because once you have to calculate all these four factors and then multiply them it will be difficult so it will be better that you find the four factors first and then cancel whatever is cancelling with 30 because obviously that 30 in the denominator has to be cancelled the answer cannot be a fraction so the factors will be cancelled so this is i call this as the simplest formula because factor form is the best form but just for knowledge sake let me tell you that there are two more forms in which you can remember this 1 power 4 plus 2 power 4 up to n power 4 you can remember this in the form of uh, a 
polynomial in the numerator 6 n power 5 so what i have done is i have just multiplied all the factors which were there in the numerator and i have got to a algebraic expression in the numerator and obviously the denominator remains the same 30 and the same formula if you separate out all the powers all the numerators that is 6 n n power 5 uh, upon 30 and then 15 n power uh, 4 upon 30 and so on so everything to be separated like this then you can have another form in which the formula can be represented and that will be n power 5 upon 5 plus n power 4 upon 2 plus n cube upon 3 and n upon 30 so that's the second form in which you can actually represent this and this is the third form so there are three different forms in which the fourth powers of first n natural numbers can be formed very useful for competitive exams and very useful for students who are curious to learn these things so i'll give you a diy do it yourself activity you can post your comments and tell me what happens when we have to calculate the fifth powers 1 power 5 2 power 5 up to n power 5 so is there an expression which can exactly fit into this and get me the answer for sum of fifth powers of first and natural numbers i'll wait for your comment till then you can share this video with all your friends who can brainstorm and tell me the answer there and i hope you have subscribed the channel by now click the bell shaped icon and you must be getting all the notifications on your mobiles thanks for watching this video and all the best for the diy questions